Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play The Evil Within. Last time, um, I guess the zombie apocalypse happened and we tried to, you know, uh, rescue or track down or chase down uh, Leslie, the sort of child or teenage mental patient slash magic kid and yeah, so far the game still not all that scary and Chapter 2 is kind of dull, in my opinion, but eh, hopefully things will pick up. Seriously, though, like, this game isn't all that scary, which leads me to question, what in the world were people in the commercial going crazy about? Like, you never saw the uh, official commercial for this game. Like, just, just look it up on YouTube. All it is is just, like, reaction shots of people screaming in horror at this game. Like, okay, well, it meant, like, uh, the chainsaw dude in the first chapter, like, him cutting off your head, like, that first caught me off guard, like, wow, okay, wow, that, that was kind of gruesome. But I won't say, like, I'm flat out scared. I don't, I don't know if, like, this game just isn't scary, or if I've sort of, I don't know, got used to just, like, horror games. But then again, Bioshock and Metroid Fusion still creep me the hell out, so I, I don't know. Just look at those beautiful textures popping in and the screen tear. Oh, I, I should stop. I should stop. Do, do I have control of you? Okay, yes, I do. Gotta get used to this widescreen cinematic view. All right. Chapter three, Claws of the Horde. Yeah, just, just break these. Take out your frustration on the boxes. I don't know what I'm picking up. I, I just know I'm picking up stuff. Are these items I can set to my quick select? Let me see. No, that's lantern. Okay. Oh, wow. I can actually... Maybe that was a wise decision to set my gun to something. What's that thing at the bottom? Oh, and syringes. I'm only carrying two, Max? Oh, no. We're gonna have to change that fairly soon. That's probably why I wasn't able to pull out my gun. I wasn't equipping it from the quick select menu. Okay, alright, Lear learning the mechanics of the game as we go along, because, like hell's the game gonna tell me? Well, no, I mean, as long as I go to the tutorial, all will be well. What is this? Matches, why not? Why the hell not? I still don't understand, like, why is this is all that useful, because the bodies don't seem to reanimate. But hey, if, if it means I can get red, I mean, the why I say red? If it means I can get green gel out of this, that's fine. Just having a nice old romp through this haunted ruin. Shed some light on this situation here. Shit. Well, there's no turning back. All right, so let me just turn that off then. What the hell is going to happen? Who's going to pop out and try to kill me? I know cliches and archetypes and video games and why not? Yeah, I'm full on syringe. Oh, you used your foot that time. Oh, okay. Switching it up, huh? Got green gel. Okay, I'm just gonna stop burning bodies willy-nilly. It's, it's not like they're really giving me anything. Is something spooky in here? Jump scare! Jump scare! Yeah, um, like I'm about to open that door. Something's gonna happen in here. I can just tell. Wanna know how I can tell? Because I've seen quite a few 
survival horror games in my time. Yeah, you stomped that thing with, like, extreme hate. What's really going on, Sebastian Castellanos? Okay, well, what's really going on is that I'm a freaking moron. <laughs> wow. Okay, I don't want to get close enough to activate those things. Maybe I can, like, I don't know, uh, just deactivate them. But hey, I'm about to do the American thing and shoot them. All right, there's one more over there for America. I would not recommend doing this during an actual zombie apocalypse or whatever the hell is going on in this game. Because that could alert quite a few things to your location. Just saying, you know. And that was survival tips with capitalists. Whatever you decide to do with them is up to you. Okay, let's be on the lookout for traps and evil. That's the name of the game, Evil Within. There's evil within these walls, I can tell it. I'm just on edge for traps now. That, that seems to be what's really killing me. Do I want a bottle? Yeah, I'll pick up a bottle. Why not? Ooh, but this bottle is shinier. Okay, I heard people. Who's there? No, don't shoot. I'm not one of them. I'm a doctor. Marcelo Jimenez. You were in the ambulance before a crash, right? Oh, him! He's alive. Have you seen anyone else? My patient, Leslie. I saw him running up ahead, but... But? Come this way. Quietly, mind you. Okay, but... First things first, I'm going to loudly break this. Oh, this is automatic. Never mind. Yourself. Those things chased me all the way into the village. Me too. They're all over the place. They've got weaponry now. Through that gate. Good lord. <laughs> wow, that sucks. There's too many to shoot our way through. <laughs> One of us could try to lure them away while the other gets the gate open. You're the one with the gun. If you say so. Really? Really? The, oh, okay. Guess it's gonna be up to me then. To lure them away. What'd you do now? You mean this? Okay. But well, first, let me finish exploring this here place. So far, it seems to be nothing. Hey! Oh, he's talking to them. That old guy is gonna get himself killed. Okay, I should probably hurry up then. I can see the light. There's something evil in here, isn't there? No, just a candle. Okay. So, we actually have a task that I understand. Damn it all to hell. Really? Okay. Where did you all come from? 
Okay, wow, I, I couldn't get the kill on him. I couldn't get the kill on him. And now I'm hurt. So we're just gonna run. Take that axe, you son of a bitch. Okay. Uh, there's a bomb in there, and I'm dead. Okay, um, huh, so I guess I just have to make a mad dash to the gate? Wow. That should not have worked out, but, uh, it did. Just walking past the zombies that were trying to kill me. Okay. Wait, that's a bear trap. Damn it! Uh. But yeah, that was a bear trap, all right. You could tell by the way it clamped down on my leg. Burn, body. I'm shocked that doesn't alert things to your presence, though. Okay. All right, I said I understood. Shit, better find cover. What? So now there are people trying to kill me? Can't we all just get along? It's the freaking zombie apocalypse, yo. I just climbed the ladder. I. I really have no clue where I'm going. But I think I should, you know, at, at least have some words with the guy that was trying to kill me. By have some words, I mean punch his filthy face in. That son of a gun. Where in the name of all that is holy am I trying to go? You know what? I just don't even want to deal with that bomb. Let's just climb. Let's just do random things. We'll figure out what we're trying to accomplish later on. Okay, I found some good stuff over here. I guess. <laughs> what am I trying to do here? This game will really benefit from a map, but hey, I mean, you know, it's the... If they're trying to be realistic, you're not going to really have a map or radar when the zombies attack, so... This kind of makes sense. So many matches. Whatever, let's go in here. Maybe I'll stumble upon the solution, like last time. Did I just go in a fucking circle? I just went in a fucking circle. Okay, give me a moment here. Oh. 
okay. So as you can see, this clearly didn't work out. There's a zombie right on my ass. Okay, run! Okay, this is all types of horrible right now. This, get, this will at least give me some time. Oh, wait, no, I got syringes. That's right. Okay. Do I dare fight them? No, that one has an axe. What did he just do? What ha Oh, okay, so I guess a zombie snuck up on me while I was watching that sentient one activate something? I uh this is utterly confusing but at least I think I know where I need to go to get around that uh guy with the gun gonna lose out on a lot of stuff I collected but hey Okay, I climbed up here because I don't know why. And Well, that's nice to have. Too bad I don't have a crossbow. And this still doesn't help me with dude that's busting caps in my candy ass. So I I don't know. I I, I don't understand what must be done here. Okay, so dude is shooting me. He does have stairs right near him, and then there are zombies over there. So if I can use a bottle to distract the zombies that are over in that section, I could probably sneak up behind them and kill them. And is that a zombie or a human? Right there. That's something. I don't know. But, th this whole thing is just scary, with lack of a better term. Stress-inducing? Yeah, let, let, let's go with that, stress-inducing. If you fall down, I swear to God, okay. Oh, that's a dead body. I'm like, is somebody flying? But no. Is there a way for me to get in there? We shall see. <laughs> 